Crossers and boarders, of course, love our snowy winters and spring here in Colorado. And that snowpack, well, it plays an incredibly vital ro role in our water supply and the water supply really across the West. Well, a new study from federal scientists says our state may only get half the snow it does right now in just 60 years time. Our Mountain Newsroom reporter Spencer Wilson spoke with scientists behind these findings. And Spencer, they say it's really not actually about the snow or even rainfall. Yeah, they say regardless of the precipitation, Colorado is simply going to be hotter and drier than it is right now, and that will directly affect our rain and snow. It's not good news for Colorado, especially the high country where snow is a major part of the economy. Just imagine your favorite ski resort with half the snow. Co-author Katrina Bennett says her team looked at five indicators to consider how the climate in Colorado is changing. We looked at dry days, maximum temperature, um, minimum soil moisture, minimum runoff or stream flow, and uh, evapotranspiration. After a series of simulations and a new tool called machine learning, Bennett's team got a clearer picture of Colorado's future, a hotter, drier future. You might have guessed the culprit by now. It is climate change. <laughs> and just to be sure, they modeled out different levels of precipitation if we were in a warm, wet climate or a hot, dry one. But both show decreases in snowpack. We had that earlier runoff occurring, and then a hotter summer means more water just being evaporated from the land surface, from the reservoirs, from these traditional reservoirs that we used to have that would hold our snowpacks, hold our water over the years so we could use it for agriculture and other purposes. Those are becoming less and less available to us as we look ahead into the future. Bennett said this is more a warning to our decision makers for what's to come. I'm not saying that there will be no snow in the future, but overall we'll see this strong reduction projected. Now Bennett told me Colorado is not alone. All of the Colorado River Basin being Utah, New Mexico and Arizona are also going to be hotter, drier climates with less moisture around them. Live in Summit County, Spencer Wilson covering Colorado first.